what is poppin in today's video i'm about to showcase you guys how to evolve your electabuzz into electivire in pokemon sword and shield now this process is basically simple and easy all you guys are gonna need is the item electric zire which the item that is used to evolve electivuzz into electiv electivire now this items can be found basically in the giant bed and the crown tundra dlc now if you guys have the crown tundra dlc which i'm going to showcase you guys in a minute if you go to the the giant's bed in the corner between that little puddle of water you guys should, should see the item that is used to evolve elective buzz into elective fire now you guys should not worry due to the fact that when an elective buzz has at least to be level 30 to evolve into Electivire, but really you know um, all the Pokemon that are in Crown Tundra you're gonna encounter is way past level 30. So most of them half the time are like level 68 and half the time you see some like level 70. So you guys don't need to worry about that level 30 requirement. So all you guys have to do is make the hold the item and there's two ways you basically can trade um for the Pokemon to evolve is doing a two person trade when both of you guys have electives and you guys try to trade for elective wire or you just can do um link trade and you showcase the pokemon you're trying to trade is an elective us obviously you're trying to evolve it and he showcase if the person the other person showcase their elective us too you guys can trade with each other and then send it back to each other or if you have two switches you just trade it with yourself that's what I, that's most of the time i use i just trade it with myself i don't need to go through the hassle of um the first two things I mentioned, even though they're really effective, but you know, I mean, training with myself is more efficient for me overall. So yeah, as you can see, I did I trade with myself, and my elective buzz is starting to evolve to elective fire. As you see, this process is basically really simple and easy. As long as you got the the item that I showcase you guys where to get it and the map on the Crown Tundra, you guys should be good. It's located in the um. In the middle of a puddle on the side it's literally there you can't miss it. it's basically like a pokeball so yeah um that's basically about it if you guys enjoyed this video find this video any helpful at all feel free to like share and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and yeah guys i see you guys in the next video peace out